So you already know it's the Coverboy Chronicles and it's the 12 Days of Christmas special and I'm recording this to you on the 4th day so if it doesn't get to you until the 5th I don't know which day. So um, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know on some side note stuff I'm going to do my Bad Girls Club update as soon as I'm done with this one most likely um, I'm going to try and shoot for it so um, now uh just getting into the movies that I really like around this time of the year. As you can see, looking at the Charlie Brown Christmas tree, it's uh, Santa Claus is Coming to Town. It's like one of my favorites that you can always think of. Just the whole epic journey from, you know, the North Pole and then just how the whole thing just transpired. And it's not like Elf the modern day type of version of it it's kind of like the it's it's you know I'm an old school person so it's all about the old school it's like in a village and that's how a lot of stuff happened back in the day so um let's see then um the TV shows that I like to watch I love to watch like uh, Dexter's Laboratory on a regular anyways but put Dexter's Laboratory in Christmas, child, you have a sickening combination made in heaven, if that's what you ask me to turn on, because that's exactly what I'm going to do, and it's going to be such a fun time, because that was the best, one of the best ones that I've ever seen. Um, now, on the fourth day of Christmas, my new cover lovers gave to me four suits of cards, three photo shoots with Vogue, two shots at the club, and one more like on my page. Now, um, my favorite, one of my favorite Christmas songs, of course, since I had the, um, the movie on display, there's no way on earth that I couldn't have Santa Claus coming to town be like one of my favorite songs that I like to uh, sing around this time of year so you know that and it's that you better not um, cry and you better not pout because Santa is coming where it's a town baby get it right come on now um I know this one kind of flew past you but uh yeah it's that time of the year and the person that made my naughty and nice list for today Kanye West now I'm kind of I know why I made it oh today for me to speak about Kanye because of you know all the things that he's been going through and like he's had a he's had most would say that he would just directly be on the naughty list but I actually say he's a variation like even though Kanye is um, trying to get into the fashion industry right about now and has said a lot of things like right before he proposed to Kim which is a good note you know he is trying to do things to empower people and to let them know like and to, especially people of color you know don't let it stop at you know some other man you could be the difference so if I got to yell, kick and scream at the fo at the foreground with my microphone, I'm gonna use my microphone to it to its advantage. So I completely agree with whatever you know is going on in terms of that for him. So I definitely say that you know Kanye is making his moves. So regardless of whether you feel like he should be on the naughty list, I feel like it's a variation of the two. So. Um, Definitely want to make sure you tweet the show, Coverboy Chronicles, um, New Cover Lovers, um, my Facebook, my like page, my Twitter, my Instagram, and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the Spirit Soul Star, okay? That's my YouTube channel. So, um, hopefully you guys have a great cr um, Christmas coming up and uh, watch my little background update or what, whatever the case may be. And um, we'll see you back here tomorrow on the fifth day of Christmas.